What's up, y'all? What's up, babes? How are y'all? Welcome back to a new vlog on a new day, y'all. I had so much fun last weekend. <laughs> so much fun. Oh my god, y'all. I, I didn't even get to capture half the moments that me and my girl had when she was here in town with me, her, Yasmin, when we went to brunch. Yeah, your girl had passed away for a minute. We, mm, it probably don't look like it, but y'all saw me drinking all those shots. And then all of a sudden y'all saw me having fun at the concert. It was like a two hour window somewhere wedged up in there where, where I was on my deathbed. I was, I was dying, literally. I don't know how, what happened, but it was like, once we left brunch, I drove us home, which was a nice little ride. I was cool. I was fine. I was functioning. I went in the house. I had to use the bathroom. And from there, everything just went left. I don't know what it is. I always say people be poisoning me. That's my answer to when I be drinking and I get kind of... Y'all might call it drunk, but I don't get drunk, so I'm not going to call it. But that's when I get sick from drinking, I be thinking people poison me because I'm, I am I don't get intoxicated. So, And then the Malibu pineapple with a splash of grenadine Barbie, the Malibu Barbie, Portia, wasn't nothing wrong with her. And she don't even drink. So, we're going to say I got poison, y'all. So, about two hours from the time we left brunch at like four. So, between four and six, no, between four and seven o'clock, I was dead. I was sick. I was I was sick as a dog. But, yeah, I wouldn't know that because by the time I got to the concert, I was alive. I was well and I was back outside. But, yeah, so... We have fun, y'all. It's back to reality. It's a new week, and um, kids are going... Well, I don't have kids, but my baby is... Hey, Emma's going back to school. This is her eighth grade year. She actually already started school, but I wasn't going to record that because she not, she not for these YouTube streets. But she do have some stuff that she needs to get, so I'm about to go to Target... And get her some last minute school supplies that I need to get for her. Yeah. But before school starts back. Well, why do I keep saying before school starts back? School started back. School started back. It is a weekend. It is Saturday. She started school yesterday on a Friday. Which is sound kind of odd, but I thought that was perfect. Because the girl is going to complain. She's going to complain. She's not going to be happy. She gonna complain about her schedule. She gonna complain about her classes, her teachers, etc. So her starting school on a Friday was perfect because I'm like, okay, you started, you know what it is, and now you get a break. Now you bump into a weekend and you get to, you know, kind of like take a rest and then go into Monday on a full schedule. But it's some stuff on her school supply list that we need or that she, I didn't know she needed prior to school starting so I'm gonna go to Target and see if I can get that and that's it y'all welcome welcome to a new vlog I know y'all like to see me when I'm outside because I'm noticing when I'm outside and I'm partying and I'm drinking and I'm being social or whatever Y'all be tuned in. Y'all like to see when I'm out and doing my thing. Y'all don't like to watch me when I'm just doing my regular real life stuff. When I'm being a mom, when I'm just doing target runs, when I'm just in the house with dogs and in my car, y'all y'all don't y'all don't really like to watch that. But I can't I can't party with y'all every single vlog i really can't so y'all just need to comment and subscribe and we gonna we gonna do some stuff we just ain't gonna be outside all the time because this vlog i don't think we're going outside i don't think we're going outside 
I hope we're not going outside, y'all, because I don't want to go outside. I really want to just sit my ass in the house and drink some water. I don't want to go outside. But, <sighs> so, oh, the pharmacy got the clothes. I remember having five star. You was like, you had that money if you had a five star notebook. Yeah, I'm at school shopping with Kaimon and she was looking at this binder like, oh my God, this is so cute. And I'm like, you know, we used to call these when I was a kid. She like, what? I'm like a trapper keeper. And then lo and behold, right next to it is a freaking trapper keeper. I didn't know they still made these. I feel so old. All right, y'all, I'm back from Target, and that was a bus. That was a bus. Target is completely wiped out. <laughs> Target is completely wiped out, and she wouldn't answer her phone to give me any alternative options or to even look at any alternative options that I was giving her in regards to what she said she needed on her list. So, mm -mm. So I'm just going to do my little regular runs. It's not even morning. It's 4.51 p.m. So it's not like I'm doing morning errands. But I'm just going to do my little regular runs. I just need to go to the grocery store. And I just need to go to the beauty supply to get like these little, those little scrunchy socks that everybody's wearing. I want to get a couple pair of those because I saw some at the beauty supply by my house. And I'm taking my ass back home. I don't even want to be outside. I'm, when I tell y'all that last weekend really, really showed my age, I was really, really tired. I was good in the moment, but once um, the next morning when it was time, when I was dropping her off at the airport and I had to get up for work and log into work, I was like, oh, no, bitch, I'm tired. I am tired. So... But yeah, so I ain't really got nothing going on today. Like I said, I hope I don't go outside tonight. I don't want to go outside tonight. Uh, my cousin is having a party that I just thought about. My cousin is having a party tonight. And I might just pop in and pop out. Nothing. Yeah, I might just pop in and pop out. And whatever, popping in, popping out means that I'm going to have on the hat. Yes, I'm wearing a hat because mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't want no alcohol. I don't want no mixed drinks. Yeah, I everywhere we went, everywhere I've been going lately, the mixed drinks are like horrible, like just not good. I cannot, I'm going to start being that girl that just bring my own alcohol, like a little miniature bottle or maybe a flask with my alcohol in it. And when I get to the place, I'm going to be like, can I get a lemonade? Can I get an orange juice? Can I get something? Just a, just something that I can make my own drink. Because And then they be charging $20 for some bullshit. So I'm about to become that, that person that really already got my drink already in my bag. Because it's not worth it. I don't, it be too sweet. It don't be having enough liquor in it. It just don't be made right. And then it'd be twenty twenty five dollars for some bullshit. So, yeah, anybody got time for that? I'd rather just get my own, make my own little drinky drink. At least I know what I'm drinking and what's in it, and just call it a day. I ain't gonna bore y'all and take y'all in with me while I run my errands. I have a scar right here, and I haven't paid it any attention in a really long time. And wearing this hat is really like pointing it out. Like, when, see, when I do it like this, you can't really see it. You can see a little bit of it, but the shadow of this hat is really, like, pointing the scar out. If I told y'all where I got the scar, y'all would laugh. On my 16th birthday, let me just tell y'all real quick, and then I'm going to be done talking to y'all for a while unless I do something tonight. Other than that, y'all ain't going to see me no more until the morning. But on my 16th birthday, I had a party at my friend sister house her name my friend's sister house rest in peace to caprice um and in chicago we do this thing where we be roasting people like roasting people yeah i know what a roast is but everything be like get your big get your big uh get your big shoe wearing ass or get your 
get your mama, get your whatever, get your mama crackhead face ass. Like we just say like little weird shit like that. And this boy, I was like roasting him really, really bad. And I was like the girl that like I don't know. I just want scared. I just want scared of no niggas. Like I want scared of no boys. I I argue with boys. I talk shit to, to the boys. I I them there was fighting boys, and I was roasting him so bad that his feelings got hurt, and he told me he was gonna beat my ass, and he started calling me like bitches and like just all type of stuff. Just started calling me out my name. Started being so disrespectful. Yeah, I had like a um a can of beer. It was like a 211, a tall can of 211. Yeah, I was just sitting there, let him talk, and he's just going, and he's just going. Like, he, but he had, you know, when the person feels getting hurt, they get real disrespectful. So he was calling me um, bees and hoes and bitches and whatever. I don't know why I'm saying bees, like, I don't be cussing at y'all, but I'm trying to keep this story kind of PG. So I'm sitting there, and I got a, a can of beer in my hand, a tall can of 211, malt liquor. Keep in mind, I'm only turning 16, so I got a tall can of liquor or whatever. So I'm shaking the can, I'm shaking the can. And I'm like, what? He's like, you, you, this, you always talking about motherfuckers, you think you the shit. I'm like, yeah. Wham! (laughs) Yeah, I hit the nigga in the face with a can of beer. It just, like, exploded. Man, yeah, this was kind of like my, he was kind of like, cool, whatever. He was like one of the homies or whatever, but... We was drinking, he was drinking, and it just it just went left, and he couldn't take it. Y'all, I whacked, and I think he, he liked it, me too. So I whacked the man in the face with a beer. Y'all, the, the, the nigga stood up, stretched his arm, and that was my eye. That was my eye. <laughs> Laid me the fuck out. That was my eye. So still to this day, I have this bruise on my ass. <laughs> now so that's what happened to my eye good morning y'all happy sunday um as y'all can see i didn't go nowhere last night because i didn't post anything but i am up today um i on official god mommy duties look i got my babies with me josiah you gonna say hi say hi malia you gonna say hi we got Josiah and we got baby Malia. And we are watching The Lion King right now. We are watching The Lion King right now. I don't know. It's 10 o'clock this morning and I done already started dinner because I was preparing for them to get here. So I done already seasoned my chicken and put it in the tray in the pan, wrapped it with some foil and it's in the oven. And I want some black eyed peas, so I put some black eyed peas in the crock pot. So that's gonna take a while. Huh? I love chicken. You love chicken? You gonna eat some chicken today? What you want with your chicken? Just chicken? Mm -hmm. You want some rice? Okay. Well, he loves chicken, gal, so we on point. You like chicken, Malia? Yeah. You like chicken? Uh, Hi, pretty. Hi, pretty. Just like you tell them to like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> yeah, I heard what he said. All right, but yeah, that's all we got going on this morning. It's early, y'all. It's super early, so we just chilling on the couch right now. No one says stop that. No one says be here. We go around all day. Same, Josiah. <laughs> Will you know the song? While your mama talking about you, you don't be wanting to talk, you about to start singing today. I just can't wait. It's early, y'all. That's all he got. Now, this box have been sitting literally by my door. Literally, by the door for probably like three weeks now. Maybe a whole month. 
It's a doghouse that I got for Dallas. I'm actually going to, I know, I only got one for Dallas, but I'm actually going to get one for both the dogs, but I needed to see what it looked like with one because the damn thing costs $225. So I just ordered one and, um, yeah, I got this off Etsy. So I'm going to make this my project today and to put this together and see how Dallas likes the bed. If I like it, if I love it, then I'll buy Rocco one. But first, I need to see what it looks like. And I need to get it out the box because I'm almost at my 30-day marks. So if anything wrong, I'm not going to be able to dispute it or get another item. So let's put this together. All right, so trying to build this on camera is is a little bit difficult so i just these are the doors i just attached the doors here i'm still screwing it as you can see i need to like screw it down some more and then this is the, the dial caps flipped over and yeah, this is all I've done. And these, I just literally just placed them in the slots. They're not drilled down or anything. I just placed them in the slots. So hopefully the next step, this should come together. To like help do a small thing, but now I'm trying to see if y'all can get in there. So it opens up. This is like a little latch, and then it came with the little mattress in there. And that's that. Money just stick with the boy. A lot of model bitches check for me. Nigga don't check for me unless you got checks for me. I kept a split like a hobo, no checking me. Way back when Tilo had to spot it, just you. So many hoes had to get up. I said to me, she left her body home and brought her net to me. I did a walk.